Hey beautiful Geminis, welcome back to the channel everyone. Thank you for joining me here Gemini. Let's get straight to your messages. Spirit, what messages do you have for the beautiful Geminis? Resilience, Gemini, compassion. Something to do with the afterlife here. Inner child wants redemption. Be compassionate to your inner child. Something to do with the afterlife. Gemini energy, what's going on? <clears throat> My throat chakra wants to close. It could be something needs communicated. Gemini. Anticipation. Balance. Isolation. This is a warning. I want this card. It is to do with communication. Clarify this warning. Clarify this warning. Karma. I'm just looking at this crow. <sighs> Clarify this warning. What's this warning? What warning are you giving to it's the King of Swords? This is a warning. What's this warning? About a child? Oh, Jesus. Okay, this is a warning. Something to do with the afterlife here. There's going to be a power. Someone is being secretive. Someone's secrets are coming out. 
Yeah, someone trying to steal someone's gifts. Someone's trying to steal someone's lover or steal someone's gifts or... This is a betrayal. Someone's denying something. Denying that they were secretive. Denying that they were betrayed. Denying that they were getting cheated on. Or someone is trying to steal someone's sneaky, lying... Someone being very vindictive here. Holy shit. Is this lying about a death? Is this an actual death, Gemini, somebody's been lying about? Or is it causing someone's death? Or causing someone here? Somebody has been lying about <gasps> magic? Death magic? The King of Wands. Jesus. I don't know what's going on here, but somebody is really pissed off here. Going to get real pissed off. Someone's been very selfish, very freaking arrogant, very greedy. This could be to do with uh, work, looking for work, looking angry because somebody is playing somebody here oh boy legal legalities or balance or justice somebody's under judgment This is a warning. If somebody continues, there's going to be some heavy, heavy, heavy judgment here. And heavy karma, heavy, heavy pains. I don't know about this.
Somebody did something really risky. Karma. For whatever this plan is. Somebody is like... They're regretting whatever they did. This is devil energy. I don't know what the hell is going on here. This is God. <laughs> watching some kind of collaboration here. This could be isolation. Somebody trying to <coughs> control somebody or accuse somebody of something. Wishing someone was in isolation. Wishing that somebody was unstable, making somebody is doing something here with uh, I don't know if this is a practitioner, if this is somebody's under heavy judgment for lies and deception. This is redemption, justice will be served. This is about um. Someone trying to steal someone's gifts or steal so that they're isolated. Like somebody trying to turn somebody against somebody. Well, here's the wrath. Displacement. warning someone of some grief they're gonna have to survive here because somebody is like yeah fearing now they're in fear now they're displaced now they're trying to survive now they're getting the grief This is, this person is headed the right direction. This is somebody who's getting good luck, having growth in their free, Somebody might be seeing ghosts. Somebody might be thinking they're seeing things. Somebody might be seeing ghosts. 
there's fear here. Hmm. Somebody deliberately distracted somebody. So that they could steal something. This is territory. What the hell is going on here? Somebody is Somebody is doing something. They're up to no good. They're up to mischief. There's all these crows. That are messing with someone. Someone is trying to do all this so that they can take control. Someone is distracting someone so they can take control. Uh, this is, if somebody could have uh, been communicating, you know, with... Someone's been up to mischiefs. This is a warning. Avenger with her own self-interest. Look at this. This is scavenger. This is like all the other crows are sitting there planted the seeds you know crows do they go around they plant seeds for their own food for their own foraging they sit there they plant these seeds they watch them grow and then like this scavenger bird comes along and like steals the freaking food from the other crows distract them, distraction, creating a distraction so that they can steal. It's a warning. These mischief makers are going to be scavenging for food because you know, in order to survive, you got to work like a team in order to survive. You know, all these crows, they all work together. They all have a job to do. They all have a role to play. And why the hell should all these birds be there doing all the work and let some other fucking crow come along and steal everything that they have planted and worked for? Someone's up to mischief. It's telling to release something. Someone is being exposed. They're going to be exposed. Like the owl comes out at nighttime, right? There's always bigger prey. You know what I'm saying? So this one particular crow, this is funny. 
this one particular crow has been sitting there stealing all the food that all the other crows have been working for, working together as a team to plant to create this abundant uh, plot here. And this one damn ass crow comes along and steals the, the mouse. The, but then what comes along, there's always someone bigger, and this is an owl. And now that owl sees that damn ass crow, what do you think is going to happen? The owl's going to eat the crow. So just because someone was cheating, lying, or up to mischief and got away with the, that food doesn't mean they're not going to be hunted by bigger prey. They now becoming the prey. That is predator and prey. This crow was scavenging off their teammates was scavenging off of everybody else's efforts until that freaking owl shows up who is a bigger predator than any bloody crow. And they're alone. They're isolated. Because they've pissed off everybody else around them. The other crows probably kicked them out of the, the breed, you know, the brood. Now they're isolated and alone with bigger prey. Where are your friends? Where are your teamwork, Owl says. Where are all your loyal friends? Oh, they all flew away. They're in the background, soaring. Well, this one's on the ground. Rooting for that scavenging for what the other birds left behind. Look like Owl's got his talons out coming down to swoop up that bird. Do things fairly. Do things right. This is a warning. You know, you think you win something if you steal something so you can eat while others starve until... All the other flock is away and you're left alone, isolated, and now you become the prey. That's what's going on. Someone figured that they could create grief. Someone figured that they could collaborate together to pick on one little bird while displacing this bird, isolating this bird. Mm. It's like, look at, had this person work together like No. Like this damn bird. <clears throat> It's like trying to steal, like this bird's been going around 
stealing, you know, building up a nest egg here at their teammates' expense. Like, they're not working like a team. They're, they're sitting there gathering, gathering, gathering. This bird is like expecting, anticipating like everybody to show up for them when they need help. But nobody's showing up, showing up for them. They're just like, because they've been greedy. <clears throat> they've been stashing these gifts, all this collection that their whole team built like it took a team to build this and they've been secretly stealing from all these people stashing it stashing it for their own usage for a later time you know what I mean and now they're isolated expecting all their friends or all their all their peeps to show up for them and there ain't nobody showing up for them. It's like there should be like a full house here where are all my peeps here. Well nobody's showing up for them because they didn't show up for nobody else. It's like <clears throat> they've been too greedy. This is somebody who in isolation, this is somebody who is in isolation. Look at them. Had to fend for themselves and probably this is a warning from spirit. Because Obviously, something was stolen from this high priestess or something was stolen from this earth angel or somebody figured they got away with stealing from this earth angel. Tried to, like, isolate them. Maybe people backstabbing them, talking about them. Um, so someone could distract them and steal something from the high priestess but the high priestess is in isolation who is a star who is like building this minding their business staying to themselves doing their spiritual work a and people are people are sitting over here on the other side of the table here Collaborating, working as a team to work against the side priestess. This is a warning how you treat people. Somebody recklessly was reckless, didn't care that they just stole, maybe they were cheating with another lover. I don't know what this is, Gemini. It's like this is a warning. God is giving you a warning that Somebody is gossiping, envious, and spreading rumors about a chosen one, one of Archangel Michael's favorites. <laughs> and they are working together as a team to to mess over a chosen one. I'm sorry it is. This is a warning. Somebody's a sneak thief. 
It's a warning. Someone is a sneak thief. Now, this earth angel thought they were working uh, well, as a team, but somebody distracted them, stole for their own selfishness, their own greed, and it could have been a twin flame. It's almost as if this third party who interfered in a divine union did it for self-gain. Did it so that because they wanted this person for themselves and they undermined, they accused, they undermined, they gossiped about this person so that, you know, they would be in isolation. But this is saying that the tables turn, that it's a warning to treat others as you yourself want to be treated. So while it was okay for this third party to steal from a chosen one from a divine union, and now they're complaining because they're 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 gonna end up alone. Spirit is warning them that they are going to end up alone. You got to be careful how you treat people. You don't know who these people are. This is someone very high ranking. This is someone who is like the universe's chosen ones. This is somebody doing spiritual service work. And this is redemption. Somebody deliberately out of self-gain destroyed someone's divine union so that they could have for themselves And then they're sitting here anticipating people to show up for them when they've screwed everybody over. And when these people don't come, they sit as bystanders looking on because, hey, I remember you. You stole my, my gems. You stole my person. You stole my gifts. You stole this. You stole that. I'm not helping you. Every dog has its day. Now, I don't know what's going on here, Gemini, but it's like Spirit is saying, it's a warning. It's a clear warning that somebody is a sneak thief. Justice is going to be served. I mean, that's what it's saying. This is somebody who is connected to the afterlife. You know, when we go into the afterlife, we want to go with clear consciences. We want to go with, you know, we don't want to carry this stuff into the afterlife with us. 
Do you know what I'm saying? These are spirals. This is a chosen one who is connected to the afterlife. Someone is jealous of their abilities. Somebody betrayed an earth angel who may have been here to save their soul or save their life. I don't know, but I can tell you they screwed over an earth angel, betrayed an earth angel. Sitting there anticipating and expecting everybody to show up for them. Well, they didn't show up for this earth angel. They screwed him over. Stole from them. Something, their time, their energy, their resources. To somebody who was very compassionate. They were very giving, you know. Very giving, very compassionate, very caring, very gentle, very patient, very balanced. Only had the highest good for this person. And then they screw them over for their own self gain, their own self interest. <laughs> They're an anomaly. There's no one like them. They're unique. Somebody created an illusion. Oof. I don't know. These are angry birds here. This is the wrath. I don't know. Maybe spiritual wrath. Somebody wanted to take over <laughs> for their own self interest. Oh well. You screw over those who were sent to help you, then you got a problem with God. This person got a problem with God, the wrath of God. You know, they that's who they better fear, the wrath of God. You know, they didn't get away with nothing. This is an anomaly. They're unique. They're different. They're not like other people. They're very unique. They're not 
your average person. They're rare. They are sent here for a reason to awaken people. That was their job. To come here to awaken people and they've been faced with um, betrayal and deception and stealing. Like people stealing their precious gifts. for their own self gain. You reap what you sow. You go around hurting people, it always comes back to you in one way or another. That's what the warning is. They were a healer. They were a healer. They are a healer. Somebody who screws over their friends, somebody who screws over the people that care about them, who are compassionate to them, will be the one who ends up alone. That's the warning. Take care.